But first, we begin with breaking news, a deadly police shooting. We've learned the trouble started in Livonia, but it ended in Plymouth Township near Tavistock Court and Tavistock Drive, where the Livonia officer opened fire. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel is live with the very latest for us. So, Brian, what have you managed to find out tonight? Well, we do not know a lot of information other than what is coming from what we believe to be a family member, a cousin of the person that was shot here on scene. But I want to show you what we are seeing right now at Tavistock Court. Tavistock Drive here. You see the police tape is up. We have multiple officers, Michigan State Police Troopers, as well as as we pan over, we see Plymouth Township Police as well. We are not learning many much information from officers here on scene just yet, but what we have learned from a cousin who was here on scene earlier, he says that this all started this morning with a social media post showing that the person that was shot and killed here by police was suicidal. Now he said it actually began even before this morning morning last night with a phone call between his ex-wife an argument there that with the ex-wife that was out of town take a listen to what the cousin had to say here I realized when my mom had called me it said that he had posted a picture on Facebook with my buddy's gun to his head so if I would have showed up here 10 minutes earlier none of this would have been happening either so um, that's kind of just where I feel really bad. So scene so blocked off here, very active situation. We are working to learn more information, the circumstances that led to an officer opening fire on a suicidal and what we believe to be armed man here in Plymouth Township. Reporting live, Brian Abel, 7 Action News. All right, Brian, thank you for the update there. I know you'll continue to follow the latest on that story.